The project uh, we carried out um, under CREATE was a mixed project in actual fact. The main end point was looking at whether we could feasibly make biodiesel in Scotland based under Scottish conditions, Scottish economics, Scottish scale. So that was really the, the second part of the project. The first part of the project was actually as a precursor to the biodiesel reaction itself, whether we could feasibly install a crushing plant to take indigenous and or imported crops, typical crops that you would use for biodiesel, into that um, and then could we make the whole thing economically. Well the Feasibility Fund actually was great for us because we're a small organisation, we carry out um, feasibility projects in different areas um, but we're always looking to establish contacts with Industrial partners, not necessarily uh, large, uh, but but better if large, um, who can bring added skills and added knowledge, potential routes to market for the project. And in this instance, we hooked up with William Tracy, which is a major waste and recycling company, mainly operating in the, the west, but certainly the centre of Scotland. Um, and they bring an expertise and knowledge in that whole area. And also part of their overall organisation um, is a fuels company. And uh, not surprisingly, that fuels company buys a lot of biodiesel. So potentially for us, it was not only being able to tie up with a more knowledgeable company, but a, a company or whose sister company actually offered us a complete route to market for the biodiesel plant output. For us, uh, working with uh, academic partners is important. Um, not just because of their uh, acknowledged expertise in any field, for instance, in this case, biofuels and all things biofuels related, but also because actually academic partners can act as go-betweens. They can introduce new contacts. They can make you think in different directions in terms of any project. So on this project, for instance, uh, what we were able to do was tie in with another couple of contacts who were able to give us good and full background on the biodiesel business, on the crushing business, crop crushing, and on the legislative framework uh, that prevails in Scotland, in the UK, and potentially in Europe. So yeah, we would have no hesitation in working with academic partners again in the future. Uh, we see it as a uh, actually is a very beneficial aspect of any project such as this.